Welcome back to the channel everybody. I am Florida Boy and this is my EDC channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at another product from Exter and uh, this one is actually really cool and if you don't have one of these or at least have something like this you should definitely go check it out. I'll put a link down in the description below and don't forget you can use my discount code which will also be down there to save you a little bit more money if you decide to pick one up. Um, yeah so uh, let's let's go ahead and get into it. We're gonna be looking at the Exter Tracker Card. This video is brought to you by Exter. Founders Olivier and Rick launched Exter on Kickstarter roughly five years ago. Now with a team of over 40 employees, they are in 11 countries. Exter creates premium products that are sustainable and reliable. Their vision is to leave the biggest impact on how you move through the world with the smallest impact to the world itself. You'll find all kinds of premium gear on the Extra website, with each piece having a wide array of colors to choose from. And if you're having a tough time making a decision, take the quiz. It'll take roughly 30 seconds or less to answer the six questions on the quiz, but once you've powered through that, you'll get recommendations on products that have been tailored to you based off of the answers that you provided. So, what are you waiting for? Head on over to Extra's website and check out their gear, or take the quiz, and then they'll tell you exactly what you're looking for. It really couldn't be easier. All right, so a couple things to know about this. It's awesome. There's number one. <laughs> um, number two is going to be that uh, this is an app-driven tracker card. Here you go. There's the back of the packaging for you. Extra always has super, super awesome packaging. So I have I have been using this. Um, I wanted to be able to use it before I did a review on it, so that is, I put it back in the box just just for the video. Um, that's why this is this is not an unboxing. I've already done that. I just wanted you to see what it looks like when you get one. So what do you what do you what are you supposed to use this thing for? Well, uh, I like it for a couple a couple reasons, and there's a couple things that I'm a little. Um, for, for me personally, um, there's a couple, like at least one thing. I think there's only one thing actually uh, that kind of bothers me uh, just a little. And it's just a nitpick. It really isn't that big of a deal. But it is a very, very small nitpick for me. Um, you know you know how I, how I kind of do my reviews and stuff. Uh, I'm just going to be 100% open and honest. And we'll, we'll talk about it. So let's, uh, let's get some other extra stuff on the table. Here we go. So here is the aluminum card holder wallet, and here is the Parliament wallet, uh, and mine's like a Merlot red color. Uh, I've actually been carrying this a lot. Uh, I think I'm going to start carrying this one, give him a little bit of a try. Uh, I like them both a lot. <laughs> it's hard to pick. But it's hard to pick. Um, I, I love I love wallets, bags, knives, flashlights. Uh, you know, I love all of it. Um, all right, so we've got our extra cards I'm gonna go ahead and preload some of these because we're just gonna take another look at kind of everything together um, extra did send this to me for review I did not pay for this so thank you guys over there um, one of the guys I've been in touch with Emmanuel he's he's super awesome he checks in with me just to see how everything's going I mean as far as that group of guys goes uh, they're they're great um, nothing but you know nothing but good things to say so tracker card what's it for well uh it's exactly for that have you ever have you ever seen the apple air tags or anything like that similar but i do i do like some of the features of this a little bit better so um, for anybody that's been watching the channel you've probably heard i do work in retail uh, my day job i work for at&t and this is something that is pretty cool because i've had my hands on a lot of a lot of cool tracking items and um this is this is pretty unique so let's let's go ahead and roll in some of the footage I have from the app just so you can kind of see how this thing is used and then we'll talk about a couple other little things. So let's go ahead and knock that out. So I have kind of a love-hate relationship with this app and we'll go over that. But to get the app, all you have to do is go to the app store for your respected phone, whether it's an iPhone or an Android. In my case, this is an iPhone, so this is the app store. So all you're going to do is just hit search button, go up to the search bar, type in Chipolo. There we go. And you can see I already have it downloaded. But here's your app, and it gives you a nice little breakdown of everything that the app does. 
and uh, it's got it's got good reviews. Eleven thousand ratings, four point six. Um, yeah, I mean, as far as downloading, this is pretty straightforward. You can look through kind of the listing here. It'll tell you a little bit more about it. I encourage you to go ahead and go look at the app before making your decision to download because it does give you a lot of useful information. So once you have that downloaded and you have your app open, it goes through a pretty simple pairing process that teaches you how to pair whatever device you got to the app. And then once you have that paired, then you will see this screen. On the screen, you see a couple things. You have your map, your settings, and most notably, right here in the middle, you have the list of devices you have synced to this phone or whatever you're using it on, iPad, phone, Samsung, tablet, you know, what, whatever it is. So uh, right here we can see top right corner, you have your notification panel. And if we close that down, let's go ahead and open up the extra app. So here on the app, you can see a couple different things. It's going to show you exactly where your device is that you clicked on. And if we slide up here, here we go. We can see all this good stuff. So Ring Define is super cool. Uh, if you click on that, it will start ringing up the little card. And like I said, in my case, this is one of the uh, tracking cards. It'll start ringing and actually it's loud enough to where I can find it. Um, probably would be good to find it if you left your wallet laying around the house. I don't know how well it would be outside. It's not the loudest thing in the world, but it definitely is loud enough to catch your attention. See if there we go. You can hear mine ringing and we'll go ahead and stop that. So you can set up a kind of a large array of alerts. So we have out of range alerts. You can turn this on and off. This will let you know whenever you're out of range of your wallet or whatever you have the card in. Uh, I kind of leave the card in one of my backup wallets in my EDC bag. So, you know, if I walk away without my bag or if I forget my bag or any, you know, if my bag starts growing legs and trying to walk away, the app's going to alert me. So aside from that, you can click on directions. Uh, we'll go back to that here in just a second. Uh, share with Exter. Um, invite your friends and family. So this, you can send this feature to multiple people. Uh, it says this feature enables you to connect multiple devices to one Chipolo. Um, basically just to kind of like a family sharing mode. Uh, so change ringtone. You can see we have a bunch of different ringtones. I'll go over a couple of those. <laughs> this is so funny. Pixel Dance and Dots and Dashes. Uh, I actually was trying to choose between Dots and Dashes and the Chipolo sound. I think I'm just going to take the Chipolo because it's kind of unique. Uh, aside from that, you can also use this to take a selfie. So if you do set your phone away or off in a corner on a tripod or just even leaned up against a wall or something, and you're holding whatever device, uh, most of them have a button. So if you click the button while you're open in this mode, from there you'll be able to take a photo uh, just by clicking the button. Don't mind my notification that just popped up. It's just a game that I play. <laughs> so next we can go to settings. You can actually name the device. So from here, I'm going to name mine tracker card. And then we'll hit done. Go back. There it is. You can also remove from your account with that little button down there at the bottom. You can hit get free Chipolo. Here we go, let this load up, and you can get a free one by inviting friends. Super easy, it's a lot of fun. Uh, anytime you invite a friend, they get a 20% discount. And uh, yeah, the app is really easy, it's really convenient. There's not really a lot of mess to go along with, with having to learn how to use it. It's pretty straightforward, especially if you've had anything, you know, like a tracking card or anything that's app-based. Um, then you'll, you know, you'll kind of know exactly what to do. If you hit directions, this will give you directions right to where your card's at. This shows you me, there you go. And we'll go back to Chipolo. And I mean, that's about it. That's about all there is to this. Uh, when you go back to the home screen, there it is. You can always hit add new device. This asks you if it is the one or the card. Um, and there's also partnered products here that you can also uh, track from this app. So one of the things that I am not a huge fan of from this app is that you have to leave the app open on an iPhone. I haven't tested it on a Samsung. I would assume it's pretty close to the same. Not a huge deal. I mean, honestly, it's really not a deal breaker, but you have to leave the app open. 
And if you close out the app, you get a nice little notification that lets you know you closed the app and you're not tracking anymore. So it lets you know if you're one of those like me that just immediately closes an app anytime you get in and out of there. Uh, you know, just, just, one, just one thing you have to worry about. Don't close the app. But, but that's all. Let's go back to the table. All right. So this tracker card. There's a lot of really, really cool things I really do like about it. And uh, one of it be, or one of them being solar powered. That is awesome. Uh, just every now and then to, to be honest, I, I've had this um, going on three months. I've been, I've been using it and playing with it and uh, I like it, I like it a lot. Uh, there's, like I said, one small thing that I, I have to nitpick and we'll talk about that here in a second. But since I've had this, I haven't had to go, okay, I need to set this in the sun. It needs to charge. I haven't had to do that. And, um, that, I mean, for me, that's, that's awesome. I mean, I can't, I can't, I cannot complain a single bit about that. The bad, the battery life <clears throat> voices, my voice is kind of being funky. Hold on. Let me, uh, mm. okay. Better. <laughs> I'm not going to edit that out either. So the, the battery life of this thing, um, I mean, like I said, I'm being I'm being 100 percent for real. Uh, I have not had to actually say, okay, I need to charge this. And Exter actually states on the website that this will get two to three months <laughs> on battery life from about three hours worth of charge. So I can tell you that that is true. Um, this this I have been using as a wallet in my pocket. And I've been using it as a, also have used it as a backup wallet in my EDC bag. So this thing has, you know, I've been, I've been carrying it. I, I be carrying it often. <laughs> so where this guy has set for me, I've slid it in the back and it's set right here. And to be honest, I love keeping this as a backup. I took my cards out because you know, people, YouTube, um, so I love keeping this in my bag. I do carry a bag to work every single day. And I love keeping this in the bag with the card because of one really, really, really cool feature. So the range of this tracker card is roughly 200 feet. Um, yes, uh, yes. So it, it also depends on, you know, walls and structure material and where you're at and yada, yada, yada. Uh, whether or not you get the true 200, uh, you know, thing, things do cause interference. We're talking Bluetooth. Bluetooth is not a foolproof uh, wireless technology. So um, Bluetooth does have its limitations. But uh, I will say one thing that has given me a major peace of mind. Yeah, and you see this thing fits. <laughs> things are, it's, it's hard to get out, but I never pull it out of there. I literally just pulled it out to put it in the uh, the box just for this video. Uh, this has been its home for a while. You can see this kind of form to it already. <laughs> so um, something that I like a lot, and the reason why I like having this in my bag, is whenever you get out of range of your tracker card, it, uh, it, it tells you. Your phone pops up and says, hey... Um, you know, you're out of range or, Hey, we've, we've disconnected from your card. Um, love that, love that because a, I can keep track of my wallet and B, if my wallet's in my EDC bag, which is not always next to me when I'm at work, I know if it's growing legs and walking away or B, I forgot it because as soon as I get out of range, it's going, Hey, you left me behind, come get me. And so you're going to turn around, you're going to go get it. You're not going to leave it wherever it's at. So I, I love that. Um, now, that being said, uh, this is my small nitpick. Probably heard it when I was doing the screen recording. Um, so my small nitpick is this. You have to leave the app open on your phone. Now, I have an iPhone. I, I don't have Android. Nobody in my house has an Android. Um, and by nobody, I mean, you know, me and my wife. So I don't know if it does the same thing on Android. Uh, you know, it, it might just be it might just be one of those things. Um, where it's an iPhone, you know, this is not an integrated piece of hardware uh, or software. So you have to leave the app open so that it can keep track of the card. My, that is my only nitpick. Now, um, the reason why that's a nitpick for me is I, by default, whenever, whenever I am done with an app, 
I immediately close them all out. I, I don't leave apps running in the background. So yeah, usually just, just out of habit, just swipe and I close it out. But what's cool is as soon as I do that, my phone goes, or the app, I should say, the app goes, hey, you close the app, we're no longer tracking your card. And you're like, oh crap, let me open the app again so I can track my card. So like I said, super, super small nitpick because the app lets you know that you closed it and then you can reopen it. If it didn't do that, I 100% guarantee that I would never have the app running because I would always close it and forget to open it back up. So that is a super, super nice feature. Um, I cannot complain at all about that. I love that actually, no no complaints. So uh, you saw when I was doing the little, you know, dealio that I was doing, um, well, we're also just gonna play around with this and put this in some flaps while I'm talking. I have such a hard time talking while stuff's just sitting on the table. I feel like it's just such a waste of video real estate. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> So, um, yeah, so that's one of my favorite things. Awesome, right? So other thing to do is you can also double tap the button here and it can ring your phone. So uh, I do that a lot with my Apple Watch. You know, I carry an Apple Watch and that, <laughs> whoops, hit the button. So uh, my Apple Watch does that. But it's cool that my little tracker card does it because, you know, the Apple Watch could be dead. I mean, that's that's a possibility. Um, sometimes I forget to charge it. I wear an Apple Watch Ultra and I can go several, several days without charging it. And sometimes I just go one day too long and I go to work and there you go. No, no charge. But I do, I do love these cards. Um, re really, really, they, I wish I had a card that doesn't have do, 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 do on it. Um, we'll say this. So here's my cash app, dollar sign Florida boy EDC. And you can see size wise, we are about the same size. I'm not going to tip too far because I'm not trying to show off my cash app card number, but yeah, see it, it really, it really isn't that much bigger of a card than a normal card. So I have used this in the extra wallets. Um, so with this card, actually, you're supposed to slide it into here. Um, to be honest, I, oops, let me throw it around. Durability test. Uh, I am pretty partial to sliding the card in the money bands. Um, I just, I kind of like it like that. Uh, it, it's almost like a carbon fiber look, <laughs> you know? <laughs> now, if you carry cash, uh, that's not going to work. But I do... I'm one of the weird ones. I carry two wallets. Yeah, I know it's it's overkill, but uh, I have my reasons, and you know reasons. So um, yeah, yeah. Don't talk about my wallets. <laughs> I love wallets, uh, and I, to be honest, I, that sounds weird. Everybody loves wallets. Um, I love to have a wallet on me and a wallet in my bag. The wallet that's on me typically will just have a debit card, cash and maybe a backup credit card or my cash app or my, you know, just yada, yada, all, all that stuff. Right. Um, and then in my bag, I keep credit cards and other stuff I don't use very often, but that I like to have on me for just in case scenarios. And this has been the wallet for that. Um, and I've loved this. And like I said, with this tracker card, uh, he's lived back here, but I have tried it in multiple places. You know, I've, I've slipped it in all different kinds of places uh, on these wallets, just trying it. The only place you're not gonna put this is you're not gonna slide it into the actual card slot. It is not meant to go there. Don't do that. Not not good for it. Um, I, You know, this is one of those products that I, I think is kind of a, it, I wanna say necessity. It's a necessity once you've had one, right? So if you've never had one of these, this is something that once you have something that will track your wallet, um, you're not gonna go back. This is, this is something that if you lose your wallet, you can find your wallet. If you get out of range of your wallet, it lets you know. If your wallet falls out of your back pocket or if someone pickpockets you and they start getting out of range, your phone goes, hey, where's your wallet? So 
Yeah, this is one of those things. If you've never had one of these before, I urge you to get one. Um, now, I'm not trying to sell you on Exter. Yes, theirs is fantastic. And I haven't had any issues with it. Like I said, other than my tiny, tiny little nitpick about the app and having to leave it open. But that is to be expected. And I am OCD about closing my apps. So, you know, that's a me thing, not a you thing, unless you're like me. And then that might be a you thing. So aside from that, <laughs> I love this. Uh, it's very comparable to my AirTags. Um, but it's, you know, it, it easily goes in any wallet. That's the only problem with an AirTag is you have to have an AirTag wallet. And uh, I don't I don't necessarily care for that. Now, Extra does have AirTag wallets. Even though it's not my thing, it might be your thing. And um, you, you can. So they, you know, even if you don't want to use their card, they do have wallets where you can just go buy an Apple AirTag and pop it in the wallet, right? That's, I mean, that's, that's all you have to do. Um, so definitely, definitely. I had a buddy of mine recently, um, Melvin. You've, you've probably seen him in the comments. Uh, Melvin lost his OpenSea wallet. And that sucks because wallets are expensive and there's cards and other stuff in the wallet. So definitely, definitely worth checking out. Um, I will put links to the description below. They are affiliate links. If you use my links, I do get a small kickback. If you don't want to use my links, that is perfectly fine. Using my links just helps support the channel just that much more. And I greatly appreciate it. Uh, they are running their anniversary sale right now. So a lot of stuff is 20% off. These cards are 36 bucks and you can use my discount code and it stacks. You can get another 10%. Or I'll have to double check that. I can't remember what percentage my discount code is. <laughs> um, but, you know, either either way, you can always use my code, get a little bit more of a discount. Um, like I said, guys over at Extra, they are awesome. I, I really appreciate them sending everything over for me to check out. Um, one of these wallets uh, will probably be, give you know, given away. Um, I just hit 500 subscribers not too long ago. And uh, I'm looking at some things to give away and do like, I'm going to do a multi giveaway and I love my extra wallets, but I also love you guys. So I'm thinking one of these might go to somebody. I haven't decided because I love shiny and I love Merlot leather, even though this is, this is vegan leather, but they're both, they're both great. I love them both. Doesn't have to be real leather, vegan leather, eco-friendly, great, 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 great stuff. Uh, the only thing I miss about this is you just don't get that leather smell but that's also a good and a bad thing leather smell is kind of burly this is definitely a gentleman's wallet so you really don't want those those smells on here i look man i love this wallet <laughs> that's probably going to be this one <laughs> let's give it away because I, I oh man i love that i love that wallet so let's wrap it up uh we are like what 20 minutes ish somewhere around there i ramble but I, I, I love these. I, I've been using these for three months now. So you've got you've got a three-month review person that has used these <laughs> words. Words aren't working for me today. Yes. So can't recommend them enough. Check the links down below in the description if you'd like to go check them out. I will put all the necessary links down there so that you are easily able to go do that. Um, I appreciate you guys stopping by, checking out the content, checking out the channel. If you like this video, please hit that like button. And if you'd like to see more of what I do, hit subscribe. I post every day, pretty much all the time. <laughs> Thanks again, guys. Catch you on the next one.